Hello everyone. I hope you are all doing well and are having a happy holidays. And Merry Christmas to anyone who's celebrating today. This is going to be a fairly relaxed video. I wanted to share some paintings I did in my journal from Lotus Blue Book Art over on Instagram. I mentioned her in my last video as I painted some of the pictures from her stories, but her main job is creating handmade journals. All of her work is absolutely beautiful, and this particular journal is from her storyteller collection released in late October, early November, I believe. The details on the journal is really beautiful and extraordinary, and I believe the cover is also a hand-painted design that she printed on canvas. The journal I have is called Peacock Garden, but there are many other gorgeous designs in the collection as well. As you know, I'm a sucker for packaging, and her journal is really no exception. It came in this beautiful box and organza bag. Inside was also dried lavender, but because I received this journal a while ago, I had already taken it out. The paper is handmade, 100% cotton rag paper, 210 GSM. And I chose the option to have mine gilded on the sides, if that's the correct term. For the longest time, I hesitated painting in it because I thought it was too beautiful and I didn't want to ruin the aesthetic with the less pleasing drawing, but as time went by, I realized I have to stop being so precious with my sketchbooks. They're a place to put your ideas down and have fun experimenting, so that's why I did. And honestly, <laughs> this is quite small for I, how I usually paint, but I thought I'd just paint something simple and see how it turned out.
paint I used is a combination of watercolor and white gouache. I like the pigment and transparency of the watercolors, but if I wanted a more opaque layer, I would add a little white.
wanted to give a quick update on my channel, my plans, and where I'm going with it. So right now, I don't have a set upload schedule, but I aim to post at least once a week or two. I have some bigger paintings and projects in mind, so they will take longer to film, so I apologize for that. I'm also working on putting up work on my Etsy and Redbubble. I don't have much listed at the moment, but I hope to get more of my artwork up soon. I know these paintings are a bit weird, but I hope you enjoyed watching them regardless. I made it all in real-time footage for this one. Let me know if you prefer this or the time-lapse style. Other than that, I think that's all I have to say. Thank you so much for watching, I really do appreciate it. Take time for yourself to rest and relax. I wish you all the best and have a happy holidays.